Hello and welcome back everyone to a Vicstar 123 video. I know it's been a long, long time. I think the last time we reacted to one uh, to a video on his channel was when he got his new house. So, um, with that, uh, so this video is trying everything with a laser beam, XIX vodka, sides, Prime and Mr. Beast bars. Because uh, if you may or may not know, Mr. Beast came out with uh, chocolate bars. And obviously Prime, JJ, Sides, The Boys, XIX, The Boys. So I know, I re I over explained it. But um, yeah, I'm gonna shut up and we're just gonna get into it. I was gonna say something else, but then I, yeah. I'm, we're just gonna get into it. Welcome back to the channel. Today yeah. I'm joined by Laser Beam, And uh, today Laser. we're trying everything. We're Jeez. trying like every single YouTuber uh, product. Yeah. And we're gonna rate them from who's the biggest sellout. So who's the biggest sellout? Uh, yeah. Right? Like, <laughs> EatSides.com. So we have Sides and we have XIX. I love the Australian accent. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> mm, that's smooth. Yeah. That's good. We need to see if Sides is better than KFC. Ooh. Oh. I like the packaging. It's my first mukbang, dude. Really? It's because your content is really like highly produced and like. <laughs> well, I try, yeah. I came all the way from Australia for this video. The Sidemen yeah. stuff was on Jeez. the side. 2022 is a year when YouTubers just would. Just say, please take my shit deal. and post it on the Instagram story. <laughs> and go on my story. I'm unwrapping the burger. Am I, do you want me to eat? Yeah, that's what you're here for. Damn. The chicken looks fried quite well. The lettuce yeah. looks like it was raised uh, free range. <laughs> Um, <laughs> the mayo is looking nice and creamy, and we love good, good cream. Uh, I need to get you some napkins because you are. Mm, <laughs> it definitely tastes good. As far as chicken burger, I give a solid eight. I'm not. I'm giving you honest reviews. Okay. Like if prime tastes like dog shit, I'm telling you, prime <laughs> tastes like Obviously, dog shit. Obviously, yeah. I got the naked chicken. The chicken is very tasty though. I'm gonna eat this whole thing, so that's a good start. It's definitely the Jeez. best fast food burger I've had in England. Australia is just better in general. Sorry, that might offend you. I don't fucking care. Can't for me. Oh, but it's the best I've had in England, so top, top tier. I like it. I mean, have you had fried chicken since you've been here? No, I haven't. <laughs> That might offend you. I don't fucking care. Cancel me. But it's the best I've had in England, so top top tier. I like it. I mean, I mean have you had fried chicken since you've been here? <laughs> no, I have actually. No, I had Shake Shack. Oh, there you go. There you Better go. than Shake Shack. See, there we go. Since this is like, you guys just pulling some shit out your ass. Not literally, not the food, <laughs> but the idea of the food. Is <laughs> props, props. The real test is if Ilsa likes it. Okay. So that looks like a dog poo shape. <laughs> Take some chicken, pick the sauce. Vic will punch you in the mouth if you say it's not good. I would eat this hungover and I would be very satisfied. Children. I'm not trying to be a suck up, but I, this is really, I really like this. I'm not right. trying to be a suck up. <laughs> I'm like, this is the best you could have ever had. But no, it's actually really, really good. I really like the seasoning on it. We literally have the whole spectrum. It's get fucking pissed on XIX, <laughs> wake up the next day, eat sides, hydrate with Prime maybe, yes. and um, celebrate with a beast bar. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck. When you... It's top tier <laughs> fast food chicken, there? that's for sure. I exclusively live off Uber Eats at home because he also doesn't cook. <laughs> <laughs> Do you cook? She got you there. Yeah, true. <laughs> Fair enough, yeah. She's actually mad at me. We're gonna try and get it. Uber Eats get Australia. It in, get it into Australia. Mm -hmm. um, I'll be your ambassador. Put me on some billboards. Give me 50% of the company in my country. I'm sure we can make it happen. The mac and cheese, very good. I just prefer the chicken. Waffle fries. Oh my God. Uh, we left that box closed. That's the problem. You deliver food and it like condensates in the box a bit. They're yeah. tasty though. You're delivering food. There's only so much you can do. So yeah. Sidemen, physical locations when? Soon. We ran one in Dubai that was absolutely popping. No way. One of everything. One of everything. It's, it's, it's real. I'm amazed how well you have created a restaurant. I can't believe you had a sip of that vodka and didn't even fucking break a sweat. I'm a fucking gun. The food is definitely good. I'm not going to give it a Michelin star. It kicks ass compared to other burgers and stuff. We've got our food and you know what? I feel like I want to drink. I want to mix Prime and XIX and see what it tastes like. That is what I want to do. It doesn't burn. That's good for me. A little bit of... Hey. Oh. I've tried the red one, but I haven't tried any of the others. Packaging, the blue beautiful. The so we'll do the little tried. wine, we'll just swell it around. <sighs> it smells very orangey. It does smell like orange. The thing is, from the smell, you can't tell if it's artificial yeah. orange or real tasting orange. Do they actually use oranges for there's it? There's no way. I, I'd oh, yeah. be impressed if they do, but I don't think there's any way. Yeah, 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 there's like know. some fucking big ass words on here, and I don't know what any of them say. <laughs> Are they sure this won't give me like mad diseases? I do like that it's caffeine free. Though, right? I have my like one shot of coffee a day. Any more than that just sends me into like a mad anxiety shock. You don't want too much caffeine. All right. Okay. All right, let's try it. 
That tastes really good. But I don't believe it's healthy. There's fucking no way. Like Logan or JJ could make a video on this. Take like one kid or two kids, put them in a lab. Oh my god. Feed them only prime. Put no, no, no. <laughs> them on a little drip pack. <laughs> All they can have is prime. See if that kid turns into a fat. Oh my god. <laughs> Give me some XX prime. Sorry. No, no, I've got oh, the XX oh, oh. <laughs> prime. Tell me. Yeah, that's uh, that's a good. This is XIX prime. What's the ratio? Okay, it's about, it's about two to one. It needs more prime. The orange is gone. There's no orange mm. anymore. The the XIX is too powerful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I like this because you don't even know how drunk you get and you can't see the liquid level. Oh, I'm gonna try grape. <laughs> Run with the grape. Now the grape is. I mean, I I definitely overpowered it with prime. That just tastes like prime now, and I'm gonna get wasted. Has anyone mixed them all together? That's, that's, a, good idea. Idea. that's a good question. That's a good question. Yeah, idea. we will create super prime. Create <laughs> super prime. Sounds like a fucking COVID variant. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm not really a fan of grape. Because grape, the drink, tastes nothing like grape, the fruit. It's drinkable, but I would never choose to drink grape. I hope grape. so. I fucking give this a 10 out of 10. I love great. So from off camera, we've got a 10 out of I'm 10. I'm actually mad how good Prime tastes because I'm mad how much money they're going to make. <laughs> so what is this? This is blue raspberry. Blue raspberry. Blue this raspberry, isn't a real flavor, dude. but I love it. There isn't a blue raspberry. Oh, fuck. That slaps. It's and almost like bubble gum. Good. It tastes like the Slurpee flavor though. Yeah, it tastes like a Slurpee. Which is you're also right, not real flavor. Okay, so blue is my favorite so far. Uh, I would say blue is my favorite so far. As far as like compared to other things in its class, so. this shit's on other beverages. That tastes a bit, a bit like medicine. Yes. I, think, I think people like that though. Coca-Cola is gonna pay them a trillion dollars. Mm, that's good. Dude, it just tastes like melted icy pulse. It just yeah. tastes, <laughs> yes, that is so it's good. It's not really sugary. Sometimes lemon lime it tastes like yeah. liquid sugar. Do you, you have those frozen like flavored like icy pole like? But if you melted that and drank it, it would have so much sugar, you wouldn't yeah, be able to yeah, drink yeah. it. Whereas this but is it just still like... tastes like the flavor of those things. <gasps> Typo. It says ingredients. Ingredients. Maybe that's how they get around like some health classifications. Wait. This shit could literally cause cancer and I have no idea. But it tastes good, so. America. 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 There's probably hormones in this, dude. I'm coming out of here with, like, Juice. Right. Let's make super prime and then we can add XX. We are going to create a new flavor in Logan and KSI. We want some percentage. Take us to dinner or something. Take me out to dinner. We got blue, green. Add the purple. This could either be the greatest thing ever created or we could project our vomit on each other instantaneously. Like, Alright, cheers. Taste, super prime. That tastes good. I like that. Now it's time to take it super sand. XIX super prime. Jeez. Look, I've had one sip of XIX and I'm fucking wasted. That's the most efficient alcohol in the business. Jeez. I put a lot in here too, so. That's good. It's good. Does it over, finally overpower XIX? You need every prime together to, to balance out with the XIX. Like the feet in the super villain <laughs> with all our primes combined. You wanna rank them? Yeah, yeah, let's rank them. I reckon blue, orange. See, I'm gonna put green. See, I am going green. Really? Memberly. Just because I think it's really drinkable. This is my taste list. I think yeah. that's probably the most drinkable though. Okay, that's my list and then... Yeah, and then that's my list. Fuck. Why didn't I think of making a really good beverage? <laughs> God damn, I'm jealous. <laughs> They've made a brand that visually looks great and also I think genuinely is better than Powerade and Gatorade. They're oh, yeah. fucking Without bad. a doubt. I uh, do we never want to try like chocolate Powerade bars and see if Beast is the proper Willy yeah. Wonka? Festival's Mr. Beast Bar. So we have three different flavors. We'll open that one up. I don't love the branding design. And I know fucking nothing. Whatever reason, it doesn't make me think chocolate. It doesn't make me it, desire whatever is in I here. If I went into I, I, I a supermarket and I saw boxes of different bars, this would fit right in along with them. This does not. It stands out a bit from the shelf. The, yeah. This does not look like every vodka no. bar ever. It's hard to do, but I think it's good to have something They're that They're also very clean. I think this is very complicated branding. I like the way yeah, the chocolate bars I, yeah. feel. Though. I like I that. like thin bars as well. So I look at things from a health perspective. Not good. It is fucking chocolate. Ooh, yeah. 14 grams of saturated fat per bar. It's like 700. 170. Calories yeah, oh, fuck half. off. Serving size is half a bar. I'm not saying he's done this, <laughs> but the one thing you. that I hate about brands, they'll just do some stupid serving size yes. to justify lowering their nutrition stats. Uh -huh. I'm not a big chocolate person, so I probably would eat half the bar in a serving. <sighs> Yo, well, hold up. Can we win a prize? There's a thing you can peel off at the back. Wait, I've got to enter a code to go into the sweepstakes. Promotion Can't be asked. Game. I want to go to Mr. Beast Willy Wonka factory. <laughs> you don't even get a ticket. You just get a chance to win by buying a bar. I don't know. I don't like that. I think somehow they should have found a way to put the golden tickets in it. So we're starting with the original chocolate bar. It doesn't have sections. It's just one bar. Because you know Is this what? dark chocolate or milk chocolate? Dark chocolate. Good. Fine, but I don't. I think there's better options. 
Why is it all dark chocolate? Why yeah, I don't it? like dark chocolate that much, so maybe I'm just biased, but I just maybe. prefer to get I, like milk I'm not chocolate. A fan of dark chocolate Dude, I actually prefer dark chocolate because it's healthier. But I know that milk chocolate is so much nicer. Mm -hmm. If I had to eat dark chocolate, I'd eat that. Please don't hate me, Mr. Beast. I love you. <laughs> so we got the, uh, quinoa, quinoa crunch. I can't ever say I'd ever thought of a quinoa crunch chocolate bar in my life. I, I preferred that. that meat. I preferred the quinoa one. Now that was a good one. I'm going back for a second because I like the quinoa crunch. Right, I've already eaten. <laughs> I've been <laughs> in there. Like me, like, hmm, I prefer milk chocolate. I mean, I was eating the whole goddamn <laughs> thing. So this so is the almond chocolate. With almond chunks. So it's, this could be good. I like almonds. Maybe it was drinking the prime beforehand because this is. I'm enjoying this it's more right. and more as it goes. Mm. So, uh, well, I feel really fucking bad now. Um, <laughs> I can't taste the almond. I can't really either. I think this was the best so far, the quinoa. Mm -hmm. mm, the almond, it, I don't get any new texture. I'm loving myself sat here like I know what food is. <laughs> I'm like, oh, no, no, the texture of it. I'm <laughs> chatting absolute shit. <laughs> but I'm having Probably a good time. Fun. I'm having a great time. Yeah, yeah there's not really much funny shit you can say about chocolate other mm. than does he have oompas loompas making it? Like, what, <laughs> what the fuck are we going to say? If anyone's going to you know, have slave labor making these chocolates, it's probably going to be Mr. Beast. Just like... If any YouTuber out there was going to be Willy Wonka, 100%. it would be Jimmy. Yeah. I yeah. could see him. And Willy, Willy Wonka just drowning oh. kids in chocolate when they visit his factory. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Look, anything yeah. for the views, anything for the concept. Six kids enter, one kid leaves. Oh I still think God. I'm just a sucker for like the white chocolates and stuff like the that. Sugar. But... That's what I like about Prime and um, yeah, I give him props Mr. to that. Beast bar is they're both healthier than they need to be because you can make unhealthy stuff taste amazing, but making healthy stuff taste. Good. Yeah, no, I think that they turned like the healthier option for chocolate into something good. I'm not going to review the side mint products, but everything else scores out of 10 overall. Sides, I think I'll stay like 8 out of 10. We'll take that. Nice, um, nice. It's a top tier burger, top tier like fast food type cuisines. The vodka, I'll give a solid 9. It's up there with like all the club vodkas, like your Belvedere's, your Grey Gooses. As someone who drinks a little bit of bottles. it. Prime, I give a 10 out of 10. There's no- Really? There's no, that's 100%. Wow. I always grew up loving Powerade. Every time I played sports, it was always uh -huh. Powerade and stuff. Take the biggest dogs in that industry, your Gatorades yeah. and stuff. I'd rather have Prime than them. I'm going to give Prime an 8 out of 10, okay. but I feel like I'm really cynical. You might get a 9 if you're lucky. These two flavors, just they just don't I think that's reasonable, but I'm just assuming I like them all except red, and there's people that like that flavor. Sides, I'd love to have that often, mm -hmm. but there would be other things that I'd, I'd eat sure. occasionally. That yeah. could be your staple. Yeah, yeah, that could be one of the solid staples. Man. I'll go 8.5. I'll go 8.5. I think that's fair. I think that's a good man. This, I'm going to give a solid 7. I enjoyed it. I think it's really good. I just don't think it's my favorite kind of chocolate, and maybe that's just because I like unhealthy pieces of shit. Maybe. Um, <laughs> I'll give it an 8, but that's bumped up because I like dark chocolate. The quinoa crunch was something I've never experienced before. And I think it did really well. And it was a really nice texture. I could obviously eat that. It was very good. And I think a YouTuber that makes a product you can actually fucking eat is that's enough really they all did it right bare minimum they've done a really good job and they're all like valuable products i think prime is just shit some fucking like everything <laughs> like that is i saw all those tweets and all those reviews of people saying it's so good and everything i'm like nah they're fucking bunging it on there you go i'm like You've seen the light. That is going to be it for it uh, our video of trying everything. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did the usual stuff, leave a like. If you don't know who Lannan is, um, go and subscribe to his channel. He makes amazing content. So hopefully we'll be linking up again later on this year. We're trying to convince the man to become a Londoner for a little bit. A little bit. A uh, little bit. In that right, in it. In it. You'll, in you'll it. fit right in. In it. You'll fit right in. in. Oh, queen, in it. The worst part is some people watching this won't understand my sarcasm. Um, and, they'll, and they'll think I'm actually yeah. down this. We will see you all next time. Thanks and goodbye. As you'll probably see when I um, put out the KSI vlog, I never got sides, okay? I was there, could have got it, didn't. For reasons why, you'll have to watch the vlog. I'm just saying, I'm just saying, because I want y'all to watch it, okay? Because I, I'm, I'm really trying with this one, like, because I literally gave you guys nothing. <laughs> literally nothing, because I suck at vlogging. Okay, I suck at it. I've always, has, I always have. I'm just not good at real life stuff, okay? I'm sorry. But um, other than that, um, have you guys uh, tried any of these? Have you tried XIX? Sides Prime or the Mr. Beast bars? If so, let me know in the comments because the only one of Prime is the Blue Raz, literally just because of JJ. <laughs> That's the only reason why, <laughs> because of the show. <laughs> See, I had to go to the UK to try Prime. <laughs>
<laughs> I haven't even gotten it here in the States yet. It came in the States first. <laughs> Gosh dang it. <laughs> oh, but that, that, just, that fact cracks me up. I'm like, I literally had to go to the UK to try Prime. <laughs> it was here in the States first. That's so funny. But other than that, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you did enjoy. Uh, leave your comments uh, down below, you know, letting me know which ones you guys have tried or which ones you want to try, like, really, really bad. Like, like what's, like, so if you did, me personally, I want to try sides so bad. Like, that's like my top one, XIX Prime and then Mr. Beast Bar, no offense. I'm like, eh, eh. Like, don't get me wrong. I love, I love Jimmy. Jimmy, love you. I have your YouTubes. I do. But... Just, it, ah, just, ah, just, ah, it just, ah, I don't know. It just kind of happened. And I don't know. I, I guess it's, I, I guess it's because it's a simple thing in a way that, you know, it's chocolate. It's not anything different in a way. I, I don't know. I, I'm not trying to be mean, I promise, but it's just, it's chocolate. Eh. <laughs> there's really not much you can do different with chocolate that's compared to other chocolate stuff out there it, it, yeah <laughs> but like I said hopefully you enjoyed and I'll see all you beautiful wonderful people in the next video alright mm -hmm. bye I come and go like a rah 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 they don't want the to be going nah 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 I'm coming back with the money